afternoon, good evening, traders from across the globe, and welcome to the 1663rd edition of Short Term Trading Live with Oscar Carboni. Good evening, traders. This 1663rd edition of these educational videos, and they are geared to teach you the art of technical analysis, is coming at you on a Thursday night for trading Friday, August 25th, 2017. Before we cover the topics on the board, you must know that futures trading is extremely risky, causes substantial financial loss, is not suitable for all traders. You absolutely must have risk capital to lose if you're going to play this game. Not everybody loses, but I've got to tell you that you need risk capital to lose because you know how this works. Traders, put your stops in, put them in first. Don't worry about slippage. Just put your stops in and let them get you out of a bad trade. All right, so you know about the risk, let's get moving. Omni is coming out red for trading, E-mini S&P, NASDAQ, and crude oil for trading on Friday. Now this week we've had red and green Omnis all week long. You had a lot of flip-flopping going on, right? It was like, well, you had a green and then a red and then a green and a red, and back and forth. And Omni maintained very well. We have been calling the highs and lows, getting in at the highs for a short, getting out at the lows. It's just been fantastic. Thank you, Omni. Every now and then it'll have a little hiccup, but Omni has just been kicking butt lately. Traders, if you'd like to know when we're trading, when Omni's putting out a buy or a sell in a stock or a commodity, instantaneously, come join my live recommendation service called the Platinum Service at www.livewithoscar.com. When we're about to do a trade, when Omni thinks it's a good idea to get in and out of anything, you will know instantaneously. Livewithoscar.com, Platinum Membership. All right, so what is on this board? The transportation average and the Russell 2000, if you ask me technically, are really starting to lean or weigh on the markets, and I'll show you those charts. Now, we've got markets that dynamically just flip up and down day to day, so we're starting off the session with the Red Omni going short. In fact, Omniacs are already short the S&P if they're following my Omni this evening for tomorrow. We've got other trades set up at livewithoscar.com, but for now... We are looking to sell E-mini S&P, NASDAQ, and or crude oil, and I'll show you why. So transportation average chart, the Russell 2000 chart, really weighing on the markets. We'll cover those. Gold, still looking bullish. Round of applause for gold. They need a shiny metal. If it wants to go, we don't mind taking the ride with it. Crude oil looks bearish. I'll show you that chart. And then we've got CMG, Chipotle, and Amazon, and... EA, Electronic Arts. Now, Electronic Arts looks like a great stock that's going to just continue moving higher. Even if the stock market doesn't, we were long EA and got stopped out on the low tick of the day, Thursday, 116 even. <laughs> Took us out of the stock. It went right back to 117.80. We lost $2.50 on that stock, but we're probably up $35 on CMG, so who cares? CMG has done really, really well. I'll show you a chart there. And about $44 higher now. About $44 higher. I told you the top is in for now in Amazon. We have dropped $44 since that day, and I'll show you those charts too. Traders, if you would like to learn how to call the tops and bottoms in markets for yourselves, Omni can do that to you. Oscar's Market Navigational Indicator. If I teach you the Omni, you'll know how to call tops and bottoms, too. It doesn't work every day, but if you stay in tune and you don't break any rules that the Omni has, you'll find out that the Omni rocks for you. There is one open seat for my Omni camp. I am holding a five-day, well, it's really, it's four days, but it's really five days here in Las Vegas. I will teach you Oscar's Market Navigational Indicator. Now, here's the thing. Only five of you are ever invited out here at a time, and only three times a year. There is one Omni Camp for the rest of this year. It's in October. There's only one open seat. It's the weekend of October 20th. If you would like to be trained professionally by me, how to come up with really interesting trades, take that last seat. It'll be the best thing you have ever done for your trading career. Ask anyone that's ever come out to an Omni Camp. One open seat. 
LiveWithOscar.com, fill out your Omnicamp application, and I'll call you back for an interview. With no further ado, let's go look at some charts. Okay, traders, so this is what I'm talking about. Dow Jones Transportation Average deemed the leader of U.S. indices. It is now below that fund manager's green light special that we were so excited about when it got above and rallied up. Back down below, not what should happen, not what should happen, not what should happen, but boom, it did. Not only did it get below the 200 ball moving average, it rallied back up, tried to move higher, couldn't, and worked its way down to here so far. That, my friends, is bearish. And you can absolutely pull this into a shoulder and this into a head and this into a shoulder and have a head and shoulders right there. I don't know that that's exactly what that is. I'm working off the Omni that I use each day and this 200 ball moving average. And I say that looks kind of bearish for trading on Friday. I think it's weighing on the indices. So that's your transportation average. Look at the Russell 2000. Look at when it broke that 50 ball moving average. Wow, it just went wham right after it broke the 50 ball moving average. Went back up a little bit and formed this bear flag. You see it in black, that is a bear flag. Below where? The 200 ball moving average. That's interesting, that's bearish too. So the Russell 2000 and the transportation average charts look like they wanna pull the market down a little. So we're gonna start off with the red omni for trading on Friday. We'll see where that goes. Then you've got gold. I think that's a nice looking pennant flag in gold, even though it's got a little bit of a blow through on the top right here. I think that's a pennant flag in gold. I think it's holding nicely in that channel. I like it above the 200 ball moving average. We're buying dips in gold for trading on Friday. Come to livewithoscar.com for details. And Chipotle traders, oh my goodness. <laughs> This poor stock, I feel really bad. I wonder if I have like a wanted poster with my face on it in Chipotle restaurants. Up oh, here we started talking about the death note being dealt. Here we started actually really getting involved in the chart and in the market. And it has dropped all the way down here so far with a target of 287. It's been below 300 already. That is sick. From 448, it has really cracked. We're looking for minimum 287. Will it have some updates? Every now and then it surprises you and it has an update like this one and that one, but not a lot of them. So we had a little bit of an update on Thursday. Omniacs are absolutely short. We're expecting Friday, Monday, whatever, to start heading back down here. So there's your Chipotle CMG. And now, traders, look at this thing. It's actually happening. Who thought that was going to work? <laughs> i got to be honest, I'm shocked. I said, look, for all the work I do, something is calling me to Amazon. The charts are telling me Amazon top is in for now. Maybe not the all-time top, but that the top is in for now. And I said that at the number 985. And since then, we've broken all the way to 941, traders. That's a $44 tumble since we recognize that the possibility that the top is in in Amazon. Now, I recognize it's a $950 stock, and it's not cheap and many of us can't afford to trade it, but keep your eyes on it because it certainly is a major, major stock in our stock market. And if that's going to start getting a little top heavy, I'm sure other big stocks just like it will act that way as well. We'll take it one day, one stock at a time. We're not actually selling Amazon on Friday. We're expecting to be able to sell rallies and over time, watch the Amazon continue to move lower. Traders, meet me at livewithoscar.com. These charts are the tip of the iceberg. Layman's terms, this is entry-level analysis I'm giving you. What I do when I come up with my Omni trades is much more intricate than this, of course. Come on down to livewithoscar.com and I'll share some of that knowledge with you. So, traders, you've seen the charts. You've got my technical argument, my reasoning, my opinion for why we start out with the Red Omni, Emini, S&P, NASDAQ, and crude. I see transportation average and Russell wheel really beginning to weigh on these markets a little. And, of course, we are day traders, one day at a time, but that's what we're seeing for trading on Friday. Gold still looking bullish, crude looking bearish. CMG, you've seen the chart. My goodness, is that a broken stock? 
Amazon looks like the top is in for now. It has some up days, but I think for now the top may be in. And EA, we are now out of that stock, probably going to look for another entry, but for now, no trade in EA. All right, traders, live with Oscar.com. Come hang out with me in my free live trading room. I spend my entire life there. I live, breathe, eat, drink, and sleep in that chat room. Us traders stay together 24 hours a day, basically, from Sunday evening all the way till Friday evening, and then we start up again on Sunday once again. That's at livewithoscar.com. Come join us. The room is absolutely free. Traders, once again, one open seat left. Believe me, it's going. If, it would, if you would like to be the one who's going to accept it, because I've got some applications to call, but I like to call all of them. I like to weed through them all, and ones that catch my attention are the ones I will call back. Shoot out an application for OmniCamp and see if you get that lucky seat for yourselves. Traders, I'll see you at the site. Remember, keep your emotions out of trading. One of the best things you can do to help keep those emotions at bay, in my opinion, is say this to yourselves every morning, every afternoon, every evening, and you know what that is. Stops are Come hang out with me. I'll see you there. Futures trading is risky and can cause substantial financial loss. We do not claim or guarantee that you will profit from the information provided.